Hey guys, so I opened my computer. I just wanted to make a tutorial for you because you know you guys are best. Not really. I mean, I, I you guys are good, decent, all right. So the thing is that uh, I found something very fishy in my computer, which is you know which scared me because I don't like it. So sorry about that. I mean, the bright background it just burns people's eyes. So the thing is that um, I was just using my browser like you know any normal person. So. I was on yb.me and since I'm using this search engine, I don't say uh, I, I was using my browser like a normal person, but yeah, I was, I was using my browser like a chat guy. All right. That's if that's, oh, that's not a point. All right. The thing is that I was just looking some, you know, random websites, something to just, you know, some good content. And then I have found this. Every time I open a website, you will say that, all right, this is pretty normal. What's wrong with that? But if you focus here, look at that. Okay. It, you just missed it. But look at the URL, this smart redirect.te and this annoys me. I mean, what was that? If, if you are uh, clicking on any external link, this is happening. So for example, right now I am on yb.me and if i just want to go to some other website so suppose this so here it is smart redirect.de and it is making the loading very slow and i realized it i was like uh, why my pages are loading so slow so the first thing i did is i go i just type this smart redirect.de i just want to take a look what this is and then i found this this server belongs to ad goals and when i see this ad i I was like somebody is making money from my computer and this just I mean this is so frustrating I don't know what this site is what this business is but it, it doesn't look very good so uh, the first thing I did is is obviously I you know googled smart redirect what the fuck I can't type virus uh, my hands are shaking I mean what is this I, I, am I getting hacked or something um, I'm just exaggerating that's not the thing so the first thing I got is this malwaretips.com. So let's just go to this site and see what we got here. This is some kind of virus or something like that. You're not my neighbor. And you're definitely not my friend. You are a stranger and an outsider. And right now you are trespassing here. And I want you. So the first thing I decided is let's open incog in, or I mean private window. For, you know I'm a Firefox user. I should say private window. And uh, the reason why I opened private window is because uh, I don't have extensions running in any private window. So let's just open yb.me and search. Sorry for bright mode, but um, I, as I told you, there is no extension. So Unix. Uh, why Unix? I should open my website. Let's write a so yeah this is my website by the way i submitted it to yb they are pretty great so oh i missed i missed all right no i didn't miss uh, there is no smart link so here i'm pretty much protected so like nobody is making money from me in private mode so what does this means this means that we got an imposter guys we got an imposter also again sorry for bright i mean sorry for burning your eyes so we have to catch in poster so let's just you know see i think that these are recommended extensions from firefox so let's just keep them out of this um this vpn yeah i'm using this vpn i'm such a idiot i'm using this vpn let's just close this and see what happened I usually uh, close this VPN. I open it only when I have to open this 1337x. But um, but I think I should first check. Uh, we should not just you know uh, go jump to the conclusion. All right. So um, what should I search again? Luke's website. All right. I think it's good if I say Luke Smith on my channel a lot, so I will get more views. So here, oh man, so. So don't be like me. I'm a fucking idiot. I use this VPN and um, I wanted to make this video big. I should, uh, you know, try to close some other extensions first, but I'm such a pro. I, I found the imposter in my first go. 
also one more thing i want to say that uh, i'm actually a bigger idiot because when i use this vpn i realized that oh, where is that fucker i realized that this is such a nice vpn it's it's uh, like the look of this vpn is uh, let me just show you um where is the, my customize so i usually hide my extensions because it doesn't look good here so yeah look at this vpn it looks so nice it seems like this is like the best vpn all i have to do is just click on this button and i i just you know got connect with best server so this vpn looks so like innocent but in reality they are making money from you so let's just you know not report report this fucker so uh, it contains it no no it claims to be something it changed my search engine home page in new tab with no no it damage it doesn't work oh it contains spam or insert unwanted advertising so guys i just want you to just report these fuckers because this vpn is, comes on the top when you you know um so yeah, I just want you guys to report this VPN uh, because if you go, you know, add on Firefox uh, and just search for a VPN, you will get this VPN on top. So here, look at this and the user, look at the amount of user of this VPN. I mean, <laughs> that one. Why that and why? This why? is business. This is my swag. I know, but I did business. Shut up. They all are getting, I mean, making money for this vpn also one more thing uh, the loading time of their websites are pretty slow so i realized that when this vpn was on or not even like turned on it's it the extension is on um the loading time of sites were very slow and look at the five stars people think that oh this vpn is so nice look at the ui it's so pretty i mean and that's not the case they are you know running ads or they are you know doing some things to earn money they are making your uh, you know page loading very slow so um, i think it's always better to not install any fucking add-on by firefox which is not firefox recommended because most of the recommended uh, add-ons are nice they are free but if you see something like that this add-on is not actively monitored for security by mozilla just don't add any of these add-on all right don't be an idiot like me so i will call all my friends whom i suggested this vpn and i will say that sorry don't use this vpn just make your own vpn because apparently no vpn can be trusted even though i usually turn this uh, extension off after opening that uh, torrent website but uh, at this time i forgot so that's the lesson for today we found the imposter and you guys can you know i will give the link in the description report this extension and you know and don't be an idiot always use stuff which are free and open source i was five and he was six we rode on horses made of sticks he was black and i was white he would always win the fight bang bang he shot me down bang bang i hit the ground bang bang that awful sound bang bang my baby shot me down